After a nationwide manhunt and a shootout in Albuquerque, a man wanted for the death of a New Mexico state officer is now under arrest. But as ABC's Melissa Adon reports, the man is thought to be responsible for another death in South Carolina. Jeremy Smith, the man accused of killing a New Mexico state police officer, captured. I want to thank every local agency, uh, state police, federal entities, everybody that came together to work as a team to make sure that we took someone that was very dangerous to the public, all of our communities into custody. Smith taken into custody following a shootout with law enforcement. Police say a clerk at a gas station in southwest Albuquerque called 911 this morning. The foot pursuit ensued. Shots were fired. Some shots strike Smith. Smith was then taken into custody without further incident. Police say no officers were injured in the gunfire. Smith is being treated at a hospital. Police investigating this ordeal that began late last week. Police say on Friday, Smith killed 35-year-old officer Justin Hare in cold blood following a traffic stop along Interstate 40, about 235 miles east of Albuquerque. Hare was dispatched to help, and after a short conversation about repairing a flat tire and offering him a ride to town, police say things took a deadly turn. There are some people in our society that are just violent. They're calculated, deliberate in their actions, they stop at absolutely nothing to prey on others. And that's exactly what we experienced within the New Mexico State Police. Smith allegedly stole a BMW in Dillon County, South Carolina, and drove 1,500 miles to New Mexico before the vehicle broke down. The car, belonging to Phonicia Machado 4 in Dillon County, South Carolina, the 52-year-old paramedic was reported missing on Thursday and found dead Friday. Law enforcement says Smith is a person of interest. We have reason to believe that they uh, they knew each other. New Mexico State Police say Jeremy Smith has an extensive criminal history. He's facing multiple charges, including first degree murder and armed robbery. Officer Hare leaves behind his girlfriend and two young children. Melissa Adon, ABC News, Albuquerque.